Hi everyone! In a previous video, I showed you how to remove duplicates without using any code. In this quick tip, I will demonstrate you how to do the same but using custom expressions. If you haven't seen the previous video, check the link in the description. Let's get started! I have a dataset with item categories and an identifier column which is supposed to uniquely identify each row. If I scroll all the way down, you can see that there are two duplicates here. Let's go to the data canvas and add a transformation. I'll select calculate new column. I'll write this custom expression completely from scratch. I'll start by typing rank. The rank function assigns a numerical rank to rows based on a specific sorting criterion. Next, I will add base row ID. This argument specifies that the ranking should be based on the unique internal row identifier assigned by Spotfire. I will then specify ascending to rank in ascending order. And finally, I will specify the identifier column as the grouping criterion. This custom expression essentially goes through all values in the identifier column and assigns them a numerical rank based on their first appearance. In other words, if the rank is greater than 1, we've identified a duplicate within that group. Keep in mind that I can add as many columns as I want, but right now I'm looking for duplicates only in the identifier column. If I wanted to look for exact row duplicates, I would include all columns. Let's call this column duplicate and click OK. Let's update our table visualization. And as you can see, the last two rows are actually duplicates of the first row. To make this more readable, let's go back to our data transformation and wrap the rank expression within an if function. I'll specify that if the output is equal to 1, it should be labeled as first row, otherwise duplicate. Lastly, I will add one more transformation, filter rows, to keep only the rows where duplicate column equals first row. From the drop down menu, I'll select filter rows and I'll insert after my calculate new column. I'll just insert my duplicate column equals first row. You don't have to do that, you can keep your integer values 1, 2, 3 and so on. I just do that for readability. Let's have a look. Now if you want you can completely exclude the duplicate column that we created. Go back to data canvas and add one more transformation. I will add it after the filter rows. And we are done. And that's how you remove duplicates with style. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next quick tip video.